The stars at night are big and bright Deep in the heart of Texas Okay! Trying out a new helmet. This one's a little quieter, I think, so we'll see how this goes. Uh, I'm gonna, today I'm gonna take you to this uh, spot. I can't remember. I call it the Copper Top Bridge. I'm totally wrong. It's like the Penny something, Penny, Penny Backer Bridge, I think. Uh, anyway, so we're gonna go to there because a buddy of mine, his name is Derek, he and his lady and a friend of theirs quit their jobs uh, sold a bunch of their stuff and bought a, it's like a, a charter bus, but they gutted it and transformed it into basically a, I don't know what you call it, I guess like an RV? Not, I, it's hard to say. Uh, you could follow them on Instagram as they travel across the U.S. They took six months, to, they're taking six months to do this. I forget how far along they are, but I think they left in February or March. Uh, so I've been following them on Instagram. It's Project Cod, K-O-D, uh, on Instagram. I'll put a link in the description of the video. But uh, they came by and I saw them posting pictures of like places in Dallas. So <laughs> I reached out and was like, hey dude, you gotta come to Austin? Uh, because if he is, obviously I'd wanna go hang out with him. And uh, when I texted him, he was already in Austin. He, I guess they had just arrived. So um, we made arrangements to meet up and do dinner and I introduced them to my girlfriend, and uh, it's uh, it was a good time. We had uh, we, took, we we went to the place called Shady Grove. It's a little restaurant somewhere. I'm not gonna be able to remember where, but uh, it was really good food, really good atmosphere. Apparently, they do music on like live music on Thursdays, Thursday nights. Um, you guys want some peaches? Uh, right. So. Yeah, we did that, and then the next day, he hit me up, and he's like, hey, do you want to go for a ride? Because inside the bus that they bought, they made room for two of their bikes, so uh, they can go exploring. Anyway, so uh, I got mine, obviously, and we went to, let's see, where did I meet him? I forget, oh, we were supposed to meet him at, uh, or I was supposed to meet him at a ramen place, which is really good ramen. It was, uh... Robin Tets Tetsuya or something like that. Really good ramen. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's funny. We should talk about food in a second here. But anyway, we got ramen and then we rode to this. Uh, we basically rode to bodies of water on the on the Google map. We we're like, we want to see some cool scenery. So we figured look for some water and uh, we found it. It was an interesting time trying to find this place, but Turns out, it was a really cool uh, uh, lookout point. I was going to say hiking trail, but I don't think it's a very long hike. It's not even, you hike up the side of a cliff and then you look out and I don't know if there's anywhere to go after that. Why is everybody stopping? Oh, no, that's not me. I'm point nine miles. Uh, yes, so I'm going to take you there and I'm going to show you what this place looks like. I took a picture of it and I put on my Facebook cover photo. It was a little overcast that day, but this, as you can see, the sun is shining bright right now. So hopefully it'll look really, really nice. Uh, we have two minutes till we get there, so not much to talk about. Petty Backer Bridge, that's what this place is called. I don't know if I mentioned it already. Anyway, here's the bridge. Parking is interesting. I can't remember how we did this. I think we parked. There we did. Yeah, I remember now. It's funny. There's a sign that says all along this here, up here on the right. There's a sign that says no parking. <laughs> no parking. Is this gravel? How am I going to... Uh, this could be tricky. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. Alright. <laughs> okay, so here's the funny thing. I'll talk about weather right now. In Austin, it's really hot. And, uh, humid. No parking on row. 
See that? Last time I came here, this entire row was all covered in parking. All right, so and hopefully I don't get a ticket. I still have my California plates, and I think I have 90 days from the point of, from the time I uh, changed my address. So it's only been a month, so I got some time, but would still like to avoid imperial entanglements. <laughs> These boots are definitely not my not made for walking or climbing. See what I mean? Totally worth it. Since I moved here, I've been looking for places to paddleboard. And apparently you can't paddleboard here because of all the boats. But that, <sighs> That is Penderbacker Bridge. And that golf course you see back there is the Austin Country Club. And that there, I have no idea what that is. Revisions, Mitra Tech, Epson Center. It's all business. All right. And I pretty much can guarantee you that you can't see the, the city skyline in the back of the mountains up back there because of this lens, but that's that's downtown Austin. All right, let's get up. I have no idea how deep it is, but it looks cool. So check this out. I came through here once. So I don't know if anybody knows this about me, but I'm f kind of afraid of heights where there's no hand railing. So right now I'm a little bit freaking out. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's much safer over here. But I wanted, you I wanted you to see that. Let's try that one more time. Oh my God, I'm so scared. <laughs> That's a long drop. It's gotta be about, I don't know, a couple hundred feet at least. Man, such trash over here and beer and... Today's July 9th, almost a week after my birthday. Yes, happy belated birthday to me, thank you. Belated, belated birthday to me, thank you very much. Um, for the 4th of July, I was thinking about coming up here, seeing all the fireworks, but I don't know if there was any, let's see. For Fourth of July, what do we do? Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's a, a live show that she wanted to see that I thought sounded cool. Basically, some fancy pants uh, symphony orchestra. <sighs> Was playing a bunch of uh, patriotic tunes and the Jurassic Park theme <laughs> tossed in there. <coughs> well, if I do slip and fall, at least I have my helmet on. <laughs> oh shit! Anyway, they had a symphony. <laughs> playing a bunch of American patriotic tunes and some Jurassic Park. <laughs> and, uh... <sighs> we did some research and it was like 100,000 people attend that thing. 100, 
thousand. Plenty of space, lawn space, but parking. If you can imagine a hundred thousand people trying to park at the same area, it's insane. All right, I'm gonna stop the video here. Just actually, I'll finish the story. Anyway, what we ended up doing was we went back to her place and uh, watched uh, Washington D.C. It's a show with John Stamos. I can't remember the name of it. Anyway, we watched that and then the New York one. And uh, and then went to bed like a bunch of old people. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So I'm going to stop the video right here. It's a good place to stop it. I hope you all had a fun and safe 4th of July. And in the next video, I'm going to talk about uh, Texas and why I left and how it's been and all that stuff. Anyway, fuck, I need to... I need to catch my breath and I really apologize for all the heavy breathing. But like I said, I'm out of shape and I wanted to show you that really cool thing, so I hope it was I hope it was worth it. Alright y'all. Be good and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.